Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you Google Pay versus Google Wallet. What's the differences? But before we start, hurry up and check out your software just under this video. So let's get started. Now in this case, you might be wondering what is the main differences of Google Wallet and Google Pay here. Well, in this case, the main differences between these two apps is due to regional differences and some features that actually uh, is different depending on the region you're currently at. So in most countries, so outside of US and Singapore, it actually allows users to store various types of cards, including credit, debit, loyalty, or transport cards. They also support digital keys and other digital passes. It also supports contactless payments by NFC or near field communication with the tap to pay feature. The app was rebranded from the original Google Pay to incorporate, ad incorporate additional features. Now, in the US and Singapore, Google Wallet uh, is rebranded from the original Pay Google Pay app. It continues to support storing cards and making contactless payments. It has essentially the same functionality as before, but under a new name. Now, Google Pay, uh, in another hand, is a new app launch in conjunction with rebranding of Google Wallet. So, Google Pay focuses on transferring money, managing expenses, and tracking transactions. While it may support in store payments, it is primarily designed to secure money transfers in between individuals and managing financial transactions. Now, on smartwatches, its uh, Google Wallet is available on supported smartwatches such as Pixel Watches, and it's uh, and it, it enables users to pay using their watch by adding a card to the Google Wallet app. Now, on Samsung phones, Google Wallet and Samsung Wallet, uh, Samsung phones offers both Sa Google Wallet and Samsung Wallet. While both apps ha have similar features, Samsung Wallet may offer additional security features specific to Samsung devices. Users in the US, Singapore, and India can download Google Pay separately to use its money transfer and expense management features. But in this case, what are the key differences here? So Google Wallet is primarily used for storing payment cards, digital passes, and making contactless payments available in most countries and integrated into smartwatches. Now Google Pay, on the other hand, focuses, focuses on transferring money, managing expenses, and tracking transactions available alongside Google Wallet in the US and Singapore, and primarily used in India for various financial transactions. Now which do you actually need to use here? So, Google Wallet is ideal if you need a comprehensive solution for storing cards and making contactless payments. Now, Google Pay, on the other hand, is best for managing fi personal finances, transferring money, and handling transactions. So, in this case, that's about it. So, if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.